Welcome to our lesson on blocking. And no, I'm not talking about blocking, like stopping a charging defensive lineman on a football field. I'm talking about blocking for the stage and the screen, and that's something you as an actor need to know all about. Because guess what? You're what's going to be blocked. It's not a bad thing. Really, I promise, I wasn't trying to scare you or anything with the whole blocking <laughs> thing. <laughs> I'm not a, a football player. All right, so you've got the part. You've been cast. The director says, you're perfect. You've memorized all your lines. You've been through the rehearsal after rehearsal. You understand your character's motivations, their desires, their hopes and dreams, their fears, and their inner conflicts. You've written pages of backstory about them, everything from where they grew up to who they took to prom. You've been fitted for the costumes. You've gone through hair and makeup. You look like a completely different person. The day has come. You're on the set. The lights are up, the cameras are ready to roll, and... Hey, um... Where are you supposed to stand? And why? You can stand back here. It'll be a little hard for the audience to hear you and see you, though. Plus, uh... Well, it's kind of lonely. Or you could stand here. Although it's going to be hard to act without your face. You know, I'm not saying that you can't do it, I guess. You'll have to be really talented, though. Like me. You could stand like this, but even if you're not looking at the camera, it seems like you should be looking at something. Wow. It's like forever staring into this thing. You could stand, uh... Hi. You could stand here, but uh, unless your director's making a movie about hide and seek, I'd question their artistic choices. I'm just saying. Or you could just stand here, which is great if you're performing a piece like I am, alone and directly into the camera. But what happens when we add the fourth wall and other actors? And what happens when you actually have to move around during a scene? Where do you go? And how does that affect the other actors and the lighting in the scene? That's what blocking is all about.